All right, hey, let's talk about the exterior storage potential of the Wooly Bear. There's a two inch accessory hitch. We're showing a Thule bike rack attached to it. You can put anything you want there, of course. We have the cargo deck, which is a multi-use deck where we've tried to pre-think everything you might attach there. Some people elect to purchase a third riser to string longer things across the front. <clears throat> some people get some standard crossbars. These are Thule crossbars. We have the slots in the bottom of the deck are spaced to accept the bolts of those. You can add these any way you want to support a kayak rack, to support more bike racks, to trade places with the tent, anything you want. We assume you're gonna be attaching something. So I'm showing here just a cargo strap and a side connection to hold boxes down or duffel bags down. You can put up to 600 pounds of load on this cargo deck throughout. We sell two risers standard, just like the cargo deck. There are holes and useful attachment points and bolt spacings all over this because while the racks, the risers can hold virtually every two or three person rooftop tent we know about and attaches the optional awning. Um, some people like three of them. Some people like four of them. Some people like none of them. On the driver's side of the trailer, we have the optional spare tire and the mount behind it. We have the same sturdy steel bumper that you can climb on because this thing is a jungle gym. And we have the giant compartment for bulky items. When I go camping, this is generally duffel bags full of my clothes and other things. So, a duffel bag, some awning parts, blankets, more duffel bags, where I store the solar panel. And then in the back of this compartment, which has an LED light, um, there are holes to attach things like bungee nets, so you can keep bike helmets or other items up there out of the way of the heavy stuff down below.